the latest and the best gadgets for your kitchen, please consider subscribing to the channel. This is a chopping board, but if you're a fan of Zwilling, one of the best knife manufacturers, this is a companion to go with your knives. So they're superb German knives with this Zwilling chopping board. As you can see, it's got the twin J.A. Henkel sign here, faded away, dishwasher safe and silicone on the sides you can see and silicone on the other side. One side has got a groove to it, so when you're cutting vegetables or anything that's runny and watery, when you're chopping down, it will go into here so it doesn't spread everywhere and that's all you need to do. The other side I think is recommended if you want to cut bread or anything, that side, you don't have to worry about bread splatting over it. So anything liquidy or things that you will spill over, this is the side to use for. It's got these silicone parts here to give you a good grip, but I have to say it's very okay it's grip. It doesn't give you the best grip. I think when you're chopping you'll be fine, but when you're pushing like this, when you're cutting something hard it may move, but normal chopping, it will be absolutely fine. Handle here, if you do want to hang it or stack it anyway, it's got a nice good grip to it. It's grey, the grey is not very adventurous colour wise. It's very simple design, I have to say. It's not impeccable as their knives itself. With the chopping board, it's simple. They've gone for bog standard simple. That's what they've done with their knives. They've made it super, but simple with these polythene PVA free plastic it will make serrations with your knife when you're cutting on them so it's one of the down points is plastic it will make marks on both sides so let me give you the size it's 15.4 from there to there 9.8 width so it's a medium size like a4 size sheet of chopping board it's simple, easy, made by Zwilling. It's a companion if you've got the Zwilling knife block. Definitely one to go for. If you don't, I have to say it's kind of dull. Not something I would go for personally myself, but it's all about the people who like Zwilling would go for this range to match it. This is brand new, first on this channel. If you do like what you're seeing, please share and subscribe. It will be a Let's take a look at Wallet Mix for all the football goodness. Click share and subscribe to help this good top guy out. Thank you, and let's get on with our show. And guys, if you don't like polythene plastic, I've got bamboo wood by J.A. Henkel's willing chopping board. It's bamboo wood with grooves all the way on the side. It's got a, like a dark, light, brown finish to it. Nice, medium size, quite a good deep to it. It's got the Twin Brother logo on both sides. Bamboo wood, sustainable wood, nice. You can chop on there, anything juicy will go flow here so it doesn't spread everywhere. And flat on the other side, so totally flat on this side. So you can chop other things that won't Flat everywhere, that's not juicy bread and all that, so you can use both sides. The main size it side is this side here. So nice and simple design. It's, as I said, bamboo wood. It's quite nice and smelly to it. So it's type of wood that will keep your knife safe. You're gonna see less serrations than the polythene one itself. So it's a good chopping ball all in one. So with wooden, the longevity of it is very long, so it's going to last at least eight to nine years minimum because of the high depth and it's bamboo wood, so it's quite knife friendly as well, guys. So it's trendy, I have to say. A lot of people are going for a sustainable bamboo type of wood. Zwilling Henkel's come up with this nice design, and you can see it's got a nice texture to it, it's not plain, so bamboo is quite of box rectangle shape to it and you've got the same aspect here so it's one whole bamboo wood so it's quite hygienic as well guys so to maintain this chopping board use light oil wood give it a coating every month and it's gonna stay nice and pristine uh, don't soak it so then get a damp cloth 
and wipe it clean with warm, light, soapy water. Never soak it and let it dry upright. So upright, you got it like that. Let it dry, don't put it on flat because the water sips in. You don't want that, you want it to just come off. Damp cloth, let it keep it dry, then have it upright. And when it is upright, as I said, it, all the water won't sip, it will just flow down. So you're absolutely fine. That will make it last longer. The color wise, if you do coat it every other month, it will stay nice and vibrant. You are gonna see serrations on it because it is a chopping board. There's no way to avoid that. So that's absolutely fine when you're chopping on there. This is the brand new Zwilling J.A. Henkels on this channel. Thank you for watching, thank you for listening. Please share and subscribe. All the details on the both chopping balls will be in the description. Bye bye.